Welcome to Be Here. I'm your host, Chris Marks, and welcome to Unicoi State Park. Unicoi State Park is found in Helen, Georgia, and this state park is very, very cool. Not only is it a beautiful atmosphere, but there's also a ton of great activities. There's hiking, there's kayaking, zip lining, archery, tomahawks, they have a shooting range, they have all kinds of fun activities that we're gonna check out. So, are you guys ready to be here? I know I am. Let's go have some fun. Unicoi is just two miles northeast of Alpine Helen and the North Georgia mountains. And once you arrive, that's when the adventure begins. Hey guys, we're here and we're about to do some tomahawk throws with the axes. There's our guide and trainer JD and my beautiful wife Isabel. She's gone about to kill this thing. Let's see what you got, baby. <laughs> Don't judge, it's our first time. All right. Get the bullseye again. All right, my turn. Let's see if I can get the bee and the bullseye the same shot. <laughs> that bumblebee doesn't know what's coming. It was a little rough at first, but eventually we got the hang of it. Oh yeah! Wow! This will never happen again in a million years of me throwing. I feel like a true pro right now. Unfortunately, we didn't get the shot on video. However, my wife planted one, two, three in a row, and one smack dab in the bullseye. Victory dance, strut your stuff. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This is not her first bullseye, but it's the first one we got on camera, baby. Finally. Maz, my girl. I got one, but I knocked one off. Dang it, I did it again. I'm my own worst enemy. Boom. Boom. That's how it's done, baby. Nice. Unfortunately, we did not catch it on film, but the very last throw I had, look what happened. <laughs> That's a strong way to finish. Strong way to finish. Be sure to try the tomahawk thing whenever you come to Unicoi Park. A lot of fun. At the center of the park is beautiful Lake Unicoi within Chattahoochee Natural Forest. Here you can rent paddle boards, canoes, and kayaks, all for less than $25 per person. This is the dock where you go out and you rent these guys, these aqua cycles. Where you get on here and you pedal just like a bicycle. Looks pretty fun. They also got these ones, you pedal these as well. Definitely, if you come here to visit, check out the aqua cycles on this beautiful lake on such a beautiful day. Some quality time on this lake would be absolutely priceless. The brown thrasher can hop from one leg to the other, putting your arms straight out to the sides, pull one knee up, now hop onto the other foot, pulling the other knee up, try this 10 times in a row. Let's see. Go for it, baby. This is the sexiest dance my wife has ever done. <laughs> One thing that is very obvious about Unicoi State Park is that there is no shortage of hiking trails around here. You got plenty to choose from and they all have beautiful views such as this. You can't help but feel a great sense of peace around Lake Unicoi. Just take a minute to soak this in. It's places like this that completely epitomizes what I'm talking about when I say be here. There's even pretty swans on the lake. It may not be Miami Beach, but a beach on the lake can still bring a lot of fun. Just be sure to always be on the lookout for these guys. Now obviously in a place like this there's hiking, there's kayaking, there's canoeing, but can you ever get a real workout when you're in the woods? Apparently you can. Yes, pump it up! Get stronger! Blah! Ow. Make sure it's dry before you do stuff like that. I'm about to do some zip lining, baby. Now, unfortunately, 
I'm only gonna do level one. They have three different levels here. They have one, two, and three. Level one is kind of like the beginner thing. You only go about 40 feet off the ground and they kind of take you around the parking lot. That's about an hour and that's why I'm doing that today because I only have so much time. Level two is about two hours. Level three is about three hours and each level gets more advanced. Level three, they take you over a humongous lake. You're about 80 feet off the water and that's absolutely amazing. Kind of like this shot. That was pretty cool, wasn't it? Unfortunately, I'm not gonna get to do that today because I only have so much time. But we're gonna do level one and we're gonna have a great time. Let's go check it out. Here we go. All right, one, two, three. Without a doubt, zip lining was the highlight of my day. I definitely recommend this anytime. Not so bad. Tally ho! There is nothing like flying through the trees on a zip line, baby. Apparently I'm gonna do some tightrope walking. What do you guys think? Oh, good Lord. <laughs> My wife could not do this. Because she's scared of heights. Whoa, hey baby. Oh, there she is. This is the one part you could not do. Tightrope walking is not my thing, folks. Be here fans, this is tricky. Here's some other folks doing the tightrope. What a challenge that is. Wave, baby. My wife just had fun at the gun range. Animal noise. <laughs> baby, what animal noise should I do? Monkey? All right, we're going monkey style. <laughs> am I ridiculous? Yes, I am. That was the perfect <laughs> monkey noise. <laughs> All right, we got another walkway here. This is significantly better than the uh, tightrope. That's quite a ways down, as you can see. This is the last one for level one. Let's have some fun with it. I'm coming like a wrecking ball. I promise I can sing better than that. Oh! Boom. What an adventure this was. Whether it's hiking or zip lining, remember, be here. I mentioned earlier that my wife went over to the shooting range while I was zip lining. You want to see how she did? Not bad, I don't think. Not bad. You about obliterated that thing. Don't mess with me. Yeah, <laughs> sharpshooter Isabel. And we're here at the Unicoi State Park Lodge, which is basically a really big hotel. We went in there earlier, we had some lunch. It is a beautiful, beautiful place. They got a nice lobby. They got a couple of nice restaurants in there and the food is absolutely excellent. They also have some cabins and some other uh, smaller lodges out here, but if you're looking for more of a hotel kind of accommodation when you come visit the state park, this is the place you want to go. Well, we're here at the Unicoi Tavern inside their lodge, which is one of their restaurants in the hotel. We just got some really good mozzarella sticks. Yesterday I got the chicken tenders and sweet potato fries along with coleslaw, that was excellent. We were very impressed with the food at this place. Very good, very tasty, and they got plenty of options. So we had mozzarella sticks earlier, but now we get our main course. I got a burger and fries that has been branded Uni for Uni Koi. Very, very <laughs> clever. And my wife, she got this, what is this baby? It's a veggie bowl. It has quinoa, squash, peppers, onions, and zucchini. Zucchini and she got some coleslaw as well. Looks like this meal is gonna be very, very good. Definitely, definitely eat at the tavern. Along with the main lodge, Unicoi has dozens of smaller lodges and cabins spread throughout the park. They come in a variety of sizes and styles, all to make your stay as comfortable as possible. They also have campsites for anyone who has their own RV. You can camp any way you want at Unicoi State Park. We just arrived at the archery and the gun range portion of the park, and right now we're gonna do a little bow and arrow action, baby. My wife over here. Embarrassing herself. 
Look at that. Not too bad, not I too bad. For the e. Still hitting the target. There you go. We are far from being experts, but we have a lot of fun doing it. Nice. Not bad, not bad. I'm gonna make Hawkeye and Green Arrow proud. <laughs> Maybe even Legolas while I'm at it. <laughs> Legolas, oh wow. My wife's pretty consistent on this bag. This is one of mine. That's one of mine. Right on the back. Got him on the leg. Got the turkey's feathers. Got the bear just right. Oh! Got the buffalo just right. Not a perfect shot on the buffalo, but not bad for a beginner either. <laughs> That's an even more difficult shot. <laughs> Oh brother, I got a poor bison just lipping around. Oh! First time hitting the pig and it's a bullseye. I'm gonna get you, armored dealer. Oh! That's what you get for digging holes in my yard. I got me an armadillo. All right. Get her done. I definitely taught that armadillo a lesson. Right in the head. That's what you get. Yeah, I got that pig pretty good too. I know some people are gonna say that I put that there before I started filming, but no lie. I just got that. Best shot I've had all day, a perfect bullseye on the coyote. And of course, you can't come to the area without checking out the waterfall. And a ruby falls, that is. I have to do this at least once for my good friend here, Smokey. Only you can prevent forest fires. Right, Smokey? All right, let's go check out Anna Ruby Falls. This lovely river comes down directly from the waterfall itself, making the half mile hike up a short one, but a beautiful one nonetheless. One great thing about the hike to Anna Ruby Falls that we just discovered is that the hike is paved. Once you reach the top of the hill in front of the falls, be prepared because it will take your breath away. Although Anna Ruby Falls is not technically part of Unicoi Park, it's still very, very close. It takes about $3 to get into this section of the area, but it is well worth it. It's a beautiful hike and a magnificent waterfall. I can't think of a better way to end this than with a 154 foot waterfall. And when you visit Unicoi and Anaruby Falls, just remember to be here. <laughs>